Will everyone please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance led by Army JROTC Cadet Major Josh Stein. And please remain standing for the National Anthem sung by North Brunswick Choir Director Ms. Samantha Childers. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Everyone may be seated at this time. Dr. Oates, Mr. Lemon, family members, parents, and graduating seniors, on behalf of the faculty and staff of North Brunswick High School, it is my pleasure to welcome you to our 2020-2021 mid-year graduation ceremony. Today, 24 of our students of the class of 2021 will be matriculating from North Brunswick to the world outside these walls. Graduates, your journey through the halls of North Brunswick High School has not been without challenges, but no matter what high school or life has thrown at you, the challenges that you have faced, and each of us has, excuse me, I lost my place. Graduates, your journey through the halls of North Brunswick High School has not been without challenges, but no matter what high school or life has thrown at you, each of you has endeavored to persevere. You have overcome the challenges that school and life have placed in your way, and you have come out on top. Each of you has endeavored to persevere again, and that is why you are here today, ready to begin the next chapter of your life. After today, some of you will continue your education at the post-secondary level. Some of you will serve your country in the armed forces and some of you will begin your careers in the workforce. As graduating seniors, you will be representing North Brunswick in all walks of life. But before you leave these hallowed halls, I want you to know something. Graduates, for all that you have accomplished thus far and all that you will accomplish, your families are proud of you, your teachers are proud of you, and I am proud of you. As you move on to the next stage of your life, I encourage you to remember these three little things. Do good work, make good choices, and always, always stay positive. At this time, it is my pleasure to introduce the Superintendent of Brunswick County Schools, Dr. Jerry Oates. Thank you, Dr. Sullivan, and to the graduates and our guests, good afternoon. At the beginning of each school year, I share my expectations for the employees of Brunswick County Schools. Included in those expectations are also what I have since named the five pillars of leadership. These concepts represent who I am as a school leader and as a person. I think they will help you as you start your new journey. Number one, 
Treat people like people. Recognize that people have feelings and the way that you treat them matter. Maya Angelou said it best. People will forget what you said. People will forget what you did. But people will never forget how you made them feel. So treat people like people. Number two, take care of yourself and your family. As you go into careers, military, or furthering your education, remember that you cannot serve well if you do not take care of yourself. Try to eat right, laugh, exercise, and enjoy the sunshine. Also, don't forget to look out for those who are your loved ones and your family members. They will be there for you when your coworkers, colleagues, and classmates are not. So take care of yourself and your family. Number three, ask for help. No one knows everything. There will be times when you are stuck with a situation that seems to be without a solution. Let go of your pride and ask others for help. And remember that teamwork makes the dream work. So ask for help. Number four, be the professional. Whatever you are doing, you are representing the entity that you are doing it for. Always display professionalism and self-respect in whatever you do. Lastly, always seek continuous improvement. Always seek to do better. When I taught history, I would tell my students, good, better, best. Never let it rest until your good is better and your better is your best. The best you is within you. I extend my congratulations to the graduating class of North Brunswick High School. Thank you, Dr. Oates. Now, Mr. Lemon, Dr. Oates, I certify that these students have met the requirements set by the state of North Carolina and Brunswick County Schools. I am honored to present to you the North Brunswick High School Class of 2021. They will now come forward to receive their diplomas. Courtney Marie Baker.
wait, 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 wait. Jasmine Baron Prado. Callie Ray Bullock. Emma, Jane, Charlotte.
Wait, wait. Tanea, Zakia, Clark. Erica Shanice Davis. Jaman Lee Davis. Jemaya Victoria Davis.
Chase Anthony Utterly. Malaysia, Anaya Graham. Allison Grace Hale. Romelo Vinny Hudley.
say your name you want. Let them get all set up so they can get a good picture. Are you ready? Shade Larice King. Sierra A. McPherson. Sure they're ready to take pictures. All right. Jenna Monine Pahe. Him, I'll tell you when I call your name, you can start walking. Myron Cole Perkins.
Ulysses Rangel Ramos. Amber Lynn Rogers. Don't say Adeline Ruiz. Wasting, wasting. Should be ready to take pictures. <laughs> Tania, Tania, Yvonne Stackhouse.
Corey, and Thornton. set up out there. All right, here we go. Kyle, Brian, Winship. Now I would like to ask that all of our graduates stand and face their guests. It is at this time that you take part in the time-honored tradition of turning of the tassels. The tassel before graduation is situated on the right side of your cap, and it symbolizes your time as a student. When you move it to the left side of your cap, you are confirming your newfound status as a high school graduate. With that being said, by the power vested in me as principal of North Brunswick High School, I attest that each of the students receiving their diplomas on this 18th day of December in the year 2020 are now graduated and may turn their tassels from the left, from the right to the left to signify this privilege. Congratulations. This now concludes our mid-year graduation ceremony. Congratulations to all of our graduates.